game two of Leno versus Kishmo. I am Boiled Shrimp. Good afternoon to to everybody, or good morning, depending on your time frame, or good evening. <laughs> the race is now underway. Both making their way down pretty quick. Oh, and there's our first energy tank. And Kishmo gets the morph ball on first try. As does Leno. Starting off with a pack of missiles. Oh, and there's our first pack of power bombs. There will be no hunt for that in the near future. Checking behind Morph Ball, finds another pack of missiles. No meme route today. Then it'll go straight up. Setting up to check Mother Brain mis uh, Mother Brain missiles. Last game, neither runner checked over there. And there's our first pack of supers. No hunts today. Well, both runners check it this time. Leno doing a very nice right side climb. And Kishmo is doing a modified ledge grab. Both get up there really quick. And both are heading to bombs. Let's see what BT holds for us today. And it's our first Kappa tank. And both runners grab it. Unfortunately, that could put the sauna runs into uh, logic with them being around. I know checking the Terminator item, which is a vanilla energy tank, as does Kismo, or as I like to refer to um, as a the come with me if you want to live item. When Leno checking behind Gauntlet. That or getting a power bomb refill. Oh, getting a power bomb refill. Yeah. 
as well, making their way to early supers. Very nice mop ball from Kishmo. Oh, and there is Varia. No Sano runs today. What is this scene? I don't know about everybody else, but I'm kind of disappointed to find it there. But then again, that means that uh, gravity could be anywhere. <laughs> yes, I am wiping the last match from my mind and starting anew. Oh, and there is X-Ray. Kishmo opting to uh, dodge it. See if Leno decides to do the same. Oh, there's a second pack of power bombs for Leno. I see Chad is calling for uh, vanilla gravity. That would be rather amusing at this point. Kishmo setting up for the wave Eva check. Gets it first try. And it's another run validator. Correct me if I'm wrong, but wasn't this the uh, same location that it was in the last game? I think it was. Unless it was over at a uh, Spazer, and I'm just derping at the moment. Uh, Leno having to do a little bit of a farm to get supers back. Oh, and there's our second Kappa tank. Finds a super. There, super pack. And they continue down. I will not preserve my derping. <laughs> I think it's more fun this way. Now I'm having some issues with that wave gate glitch. Oh, and gets it this time. Oh, and a vanilla Cephy beam. Or, Spazer. Is this even randomized? To be fair, Tracy, I am short, so almost everything goes over my head. K 
Kishmo heading down to Kraid. And it's a vanilla missile pack in the power bomb block location. Probably so, Tracy, but probably not by much. Let's see if Keshmo does a quick kill. And nails it. Raid is not going to prom. He is left at home. To f forever cry into the ice cream. And Kishmo gets an energy tank for their troubles. And Aster is belittling the commentator and Tracy. <laughs> oh, and there is Plasma. Never fails. No sooner do you find the Cephy Beam, Plasma comes into play. See if Leno also gets the quick kill, or will Kraid forever? Oh, a <laughs> little bit of rage from Leno. Oh, and Kraid is going to prom. But it was a short one. Lena, or Kishmo grabbing another energy tank at ice. Yes, Kraid had a very short curfew and had to be back before dinner. See what Kishmo finds over at a uh, high jump. Oh, well, there's a pack of supers for one. And missiles. Leno grabbing their plasma. Oh, and another E tank over at high jump. that Kishmo is getting ready for their uh, bubble mountain checks. And Leno is also checking uh, their high jump. And are rewarded with an energy tank.
looks like Kishma is getting ready to check uh, North Air Reserve. Very nice spring ball jump. And Leno is making a quick save. Probably going to go check ice. Oh, they do have x-ray. I did not see that. <laughs> Kishmo also finding an energy tank yet over at a Warfare Reserve. De decide, uh, opts not to pick it up. Pitch mode, not getting the uh, damage boost across. And they get up this time. Very well, no, that was Leno. Makes it up first try. Kishmo gets it this time. Then I'm opting to do a little bit of farming. And they both head down the speed booster. Kind of uh, holding hands here. You're going all the way down. Only to be rewarded with another energy tank. picks it up and Kishmo nopes away from it. And they are still holding hands through to uh <laughs> this area. See what wave possesses for us today. Very nice Kago from Kishmo. I think that's was Kagoing. Another energy tank. Kishmo opts again opts to ignore it. And Leno also picks it up. Chances are they're going to make the bet for Croc. Let's hope he doesn't disappoint again. Er, and has the goods like he did last game. gets the glitch first try. Kishmo is making the bet. And they don't have charge this time around, so they gotta have to do it a little bit more traditionally. short work at Croc and is rewarded with the gravity suit. Croc indeed has the goods. And it's going to be another free seed.
Kishmo opting not to check X-Ray. Interesting choice. They might be heading down to Lower Norfair now. But first, a quick farm session. Meanwhile, Leno is getting ready to make the bed. Yes, grapple. Don't know what grapple uh, holds yet. But yes, Kishmo is heading straight down to Lower Norfair. with what he finds there. And a very nice sauna, well, a uh, hot springs room from Kishmo. Kishmo is heading down to Plasma. Or not Plasma, Screw Attack. And is rewarded with Space Jump. Meanwhile, Leno is actually checking Grapple. Yeah, Grapple. <laughs> their trouble. It's almost like Kishmo knew what was down there. it into a room of minor annoyance. Leno is doing a little farm session to build up their supers. And doing a quick save. they be attempting their uh, uh, traversing through lore and warfare? Find out shortly. Meanwhile, Kishmo is checking fire fleas, only to find a Kappa tank. That is Kappa tank number two. Oh, looks like Lano is also making the ch uh, run down the Lower Norfair. Actually, yeah, I think that is reserve number three. Now I think about it. Whoops! <laughs> My bad. Thank you, Cheaty. Now, 
also ending the gravity jump in the hot springs room. Ooh, and Kishmo not saving before Ridley. They are confident that they are going to be going through this. Kishmo having a little problems with the K going as they get ready to face their Kung Fu Pirates. But these pirates aren't fast as lightning. And Kishmo proves that they weren't at all frightening. Session. Understandable. Doesn't need plenty of ammo for dealing with Ridley. Another worst room in the game. Leno is going for that spring ball jump and nails it. Meanwhile, Kishmo is getting ready to battle there for Space Pelican. Which chat says has the impeccable singing voice. Blasting away at Ridley. Getting a lot of pogos, which is good. And Ridley is down for Kishmo. <laughs> and let's see what Ridley has and it's bombs Ridley has been possessing that a lot lately As Kishmo makes his great escape. Out of Lower Norfair. Not the escape, just that one. <laughs> this doesn't turn out like game one where uh, Kishmo having space jump uh, gives him an advantage over uh, Leno. But so far Leno has been proving to be uh, pulling off some very nice strats to get him through. Unfortunately, me thinking of uh, Mother Brain singing kind of reminds me of uh, the old uh, Captain N cartoon. Not 
not sure how many of our viewers have seen that. But yes, it's Captain Ed, the Game Master. Kishmo offing to pick up more supers. Can't say I blame him. Have no clue where Charge is at right now. So it's a good idea. And Leno is battling his Ridley. And is done with the Space Pelican already. Your Musketeer is giving Kishma a little bit of a issue. a butt clincher. But Kishmo safely gets out and continues onward. Quick check at Bubble Mouse uh, Mountain Missiles. Ooh. And taking the, I believe this one's called the Nutella refill. I can never remember. Looks like Kishmo is going to go check Grapple. Going to find that nice little refill for him. Oh, wait, no, he already got the refill. I forgot. <laughs> already. Whoops! There's chances are they're probably just going to noble away from that, too. I think Kishmo did. Or Kishmo is very comfortable with their uh, uh, health standing. And they do indeed nope away from it. Three Musketeers trolling Leno a bit, too. Kishmo makes her way up. Most likely going to be heading to Meridia. This one also looks to be a very fast seed. through the reverse intended route. And yes, the runners are... Well, yes, Space Jump was indeed at Golden Tortilla. 
Kishmo is indeed heading to uh, uh, Meridia. But judging from the looks of it, they aren't going to be sticking around very long. Because they are taking a stave and most likely getting ready to check Mama Turtle. Or not. They're continuing on. Huh. Kishmo with all of the debates today. Grepping their uh, frosty e tank. Oh, I see what uh, Kishmo is doing. He's set, uh, going to go check uh, X ray. He never checked it last run. Oh, and getting trolled by the waivers. tank and Kishmo resets it was indeed a very smart save by a um, Kishmo's part now they're both most likely heading down or heading up to uh, Mama Turtle. Just another energy tank over there. So Kishmo nopes away from it. Now the question is, where will Kishmo go from here? Most likely to uh, left sand pit to check and see what's over there. Or not. They are heading straight to a wreck ship. Or not again, debated. All of the debates. save just in case uh, left sand pit doesn't have anything of value and Leno trying to do some gravity jumps And there's high jump boots. And after the first attempt, Kish mode opts to not try and grab it. Instead, decides to nope away. Also getting ready to check their uh, left sand pit. I 
it will probably be going after that, uh, or keeping that, uh, high jump boots, considering they don't have, uh, uh, base jump. Kish boat making their way up to wreck ship. Batter gauntlet first. We shall see. Oh, yep, they're heading straight to wreck ship. trouble trying to check that major. Well, Kishmo gets ready to go deal with it, or spank his fanny. Oh, and Leno gets it. Quickly grabs that high jump boot. And Kishmo gets ready to spank their fanny. Very nice Doppler from Kishmo. Leno is making their way up. And Kishmo thoroughly spanks their fanny. Leno is getting ready to check uh, their uh, x-ray. Yes, I am purposely saying that uh, phrase for Fantoon. Looks like Leno's having a little bit of issue trying to get the bomb jump started. And Kishmo is checking the wreck ship missiles only to find a no the last nope tank. making very short work of uh, uh, the specking room of death, which with all the items that they have, it's more like a needle room of uh, annoyance. Oh, and they find the ice beam. They can now ice clip to get it a uh, to Dragon. Oh, and Kishmo is going through the Forgotten Highway. What a champ. 
That or they're just farming supers. trying to remember where the entrance is. This route is forgotten for a reason. And Leno grabs some oat missiles and proceeds on. Getting ready to spank their fanny. Kishmo goes through the path, hardly remembered. Kishmo dodging those yapping maws. and is getting ready to be flushed. The question is, where will Kishmo head from here? Not the shack tool, that's for sure. Aside from ammo, they may be in go mode. No, trying to do some topplers. It's a nice little doppler right there. That would be amusing, Siberian. Nothing like toilet humor to spice up your Super Metroid. Modders, get on that! <laughs> Kishmo's going for more ammo. <laughs> yes, Chidi. Full agreement. Uh, agreement. Bleh. Full time agreement with you on that. Modders, get on that. Wise from your graves. Noping away from their uh, Kappa tank. Now, will they go continue up and go bowling? After. Oh. Wait, they're going to go check a uh, wreck shift energy tank. Oh no! Kishmo doing a little farm session to build up their supers.
don't want to soft lock at a platoon. Now the question is, will Leno continue uh, with the rest of the wrecked ship, Jacks, if they find out, and when they find ice? Yep, Leno is going right back into the wrecked ship. Kishmo dealing with their Batoon. Nice shots on a snick. And the snick is dune. Let's see what was hiding behind Batoon. And it was an energy tank. Kishmo had no choice but to grab this one. Leno is too skipping the uh, upper ship. Very interesting. Kishmo's in that farming mode, but not for long. Whenever I see that, a little ditty always goes through my head. I believe it sounds a little bit like this. Just keep farming, just keep farming, just keep farming, farming, farming. Speaking of which, uh, precious missiles were indeed missiles. <laughs> yes, Ron Lore. I was using that as a base. I do love Albuquerque. using the super method to deal with uh, Dragon. Oh, and there is Screw Attack. Not really useful at this point. Kishmo has out all the bosses down, but not the ammo they need. Chances are they're probably going to go down to uh, uh, Plasma to check that. I mean, I suppose it makes the farming session a little bit easier from here on out, but still. I'm actually surprised he picked it up. Uh, 
Uh, high jump boots were located in the left sand pit. Ooh, could Kishmo be making the bet? Or the second bet? Will Shaq Tool be seeing some love? Will we see Shaq Tool this time around? Let's hope so. Looks like Kishmo's heading down. And they are about to get their high jump boots. Dedicating themselves to uh, the ammo kills. And wouldn't it be a shame if they happen to find charge here soon? Oh, wait, where's Kishmo going? to psych us out again. <laughs> oh, but going for the reverse toilet. They intend on checking plasma. They are no longer acting flush. Just an energy tank over at uh, Plasma. And Kishmo is noping right out. Question is... Well, we see a shack tool now. Probably not. Again, Keshmo gets flushed. Kishmo is not making the bet to uh, Shaq Pool. Kishmo is more or less in go mode. They just need ammo right now. That or charge beam. Whichever gets there first. It would be funny if uh, uh, Rex Hip held the rest of what is needed.
That is a good idea, Strut. But yes, Sasha is correct. Uh, Kishmo needs a lot more ammo. Well, uh, Leno doesn't have very much he needs to grab. Oh, and Kishmo is not going back to Rex ship. If I had to guess, I think they're banking on a, a <clears throat> gauntlet having something useful. Because that's just where Kishmo is going. And it is pretty much a joke with uh, Screw Attack and uh, Space Jump. Oh, and there is Charge Beam. Kishmo is in official yeet mode. Kisho, uh, Kishmo made the bet, and it paid off. But they up to pick up some supers so they don't have to do any refill. Yes, Rockstar, yeet mode. I think they forgot they had plasma. Facing their uh, dragon. Oh, and Kishmo turning off Spring Ball. Doing some easy farm that way. I forgot that he had bombs. Whoops! Although I do suppose at this point, you know, Kishmo doesn't really need uh, Plasma at the moment. Probably going to save that for uh, when they actually battle Mother Brain. Leno not picking up Screw Attack. Interesting choice. But then again, they are also thinking that uh, they don't need it anymore. Kishmo is going for a Metroid farm session. Can't say I blame him. And getting all the supers they need. Yes, I think Leno is is actually uh, dedicating himself to the ammo kills. Meanwhile, Kishmo is getting ready for the baby. Oh, and doesn't quite get the baby skip. And they save the frames by facing right. Yeah. 
Kishmo is very comfortable with their ammo count. Very nice win pull. And they're going to set up for their zip skip. And nails it. And Mother Brain One is down. I do believe they forgot that they have plasma. Oh, and they remember. They remember they have plasma. And now are making full use of it. Forgotten plasma strats. <laughs> Mother Brain already dishing out some ketchup. Although I still prefer to look at it as a uh, Italian, because that could be easily uh, marinara. They damage themselves down and take the He-Man beam right to the face. Leno doing a quick save. Most likely getting ready for their gauntlet check. Leno is going to be raging once he sees what's that gauntlet. Most likely, anyway. Having a little bit of trouble with that wall jump. It is not an easy one to do. And they get it this time. Yes, I agree. Uh, trying to climb up on a. Uh, or climb up the gauntlet with the uh, high jump boots is very difficult. Baby is about to go down. And Leno finds their charge beam. They stop and stare at it. Meanwhile, Kishmo is getting ready to deal out their He-Man beam right back to Mother Brain. Mother Brain is down. Soon, the emergency in Franker Z. Kishmo is making their great escape. traditional escape without a speed booster. The reason why it's emergency in Franker Z, if you've played Metroid Fusion, uh, it's the escape sequence. Where, well, not the escape se the sequence. It's a emergency in uh, uh, sector, what was it, E? Oh, sector 3, excuse me. And Franker Z is the closest one that sounds about right. And 
GG's to Kishmo. They will be moving on. Kishmo finishes with an official SRL time of 1 hour 11 minutes and 41 seconds. GG's again to Kishmo. Checking to see if uh, Kishmo would like to come in for an interview. serving of uh, meatballs and whatnot. Kishmo opting to uh, not do the interview. That's fine. It's all good. takes the He-Man beam to the face. Okay. And they again are doing stand-up. Now Mother Brain's in He-Man mode. Thumbs coming in. Will Leno save the animals? Find out next time on Super Metroid Z. their He-Man beam to the face. their dashing escape.
Kishmo, or not Kishmo, I keep wanting to say Kishmo. Leno is doing a very nice uh, uh, left side climb. Don't see that too often. It's so nice of Leno to give us the finish of the race, and they're opting not to save the animals this time. And they finish the race with an official SRL time of one hour, 17 minutes and 37 seconds. GG to Leno. See if I can't get him in here for a interview. Looks like we're getting it. Welcome back, good sir. GG's. Glad to be back. Oh. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. This was a this was a this was a scene. <laughs> it was a very interesting <sighs> scene. Again, it seems like a, a space jump kind of screwed you over on this. Uh, I, I mean, based on the locations I didn't check, it either had to be as screw attack or up in the attic. Screw attack. It. Oh, it was as screw attack. Oh, I was. <laughs> ugh, that was such an easy check too. I was thinking about that, but I was thinking, like, you know what? Uh, if it screws me over, I'm gonna be stuck. So I, I just decided to chance it, and oh well. <laughs> you were doing some very nice tech. <sighs> make up for it though yeah I mean uh, I mean I just mentioned in the previous race that if I have to I'll do uh, mid or more spring ball jump through worst room and that's exactly what I did <laughs> and you nailed uh, it uh, neither one of you I checked even... the attic I figured with the uh, ice beam at the uh, wreck ship energy tank like okay you know what if charge beam is up at gravity suit or reserve, I don't care. What? Where was speed booster? Oh, speed booster is at gravity suit. It looks like. Okay, that. Uh, that. Yeah. Uh. Oh. Okay. <laughs> oh. Okay. <laughs> yeah, haven't and, quite seen uh, what it was over there yet. Because was too G busy G watching yours. <laughs> right, sorry. Go ahead. And then. And then GD to bombs at Ridley. I'm like, well, okay, that means space jump, high jump, or or, or uh, <laughs> space jump or high jump were somewhere else. And obviously, space jump was that screw attack. Uh, that space jump. Did that really uh, shift the race then? A touch. I mean, I mean, was was it ever close? <laughs> For a while, you two were holding hands. Uh. When he checked uh, uh, screw attack, though, he started really picking up this pace. Okay. Well, that makes sense because he had so much more mobility, even if uh, Ice Beam wasn't immediately available. Oh, yeah. Huh. He, uh, once he, he grabbed he... Ice Beam, he hightailed it down to uh, uh, lower Norfair. Oh, did he do wreck ship first then? Yep. Oh, well, okay. He did the checks over in a uh, upper Norfair, then went up, then came right back down after. Well, actually, before he went up to the wreck ship, he had done a couple of checks over at a uh, uh, Meridia, then went out, uh, went right to wreck ship, and once he got ice, he noped right out. Okay, okay. Uh, this was, this has been a fun tournament. I have been able to do a little bit new tech because of this. Uh, I, there's things I never thought I'd be able to do, and this league, this season one, has taught me a few things, and 
I don't quite know if I'm going to join Season 2 yet. I mean, we'll see how long that's going to go, but if it's uh, this has been a lot of fun, and if you like to play Super Metroid, I would say definitely give this a go. The first season being 18 weeks was a little bit of a time drain for people, and I fully understand that, but uh, yeah, if you like the game, by all means, join Season 2. <laughs> if there is I'm season thinking two. about it, to be two. honest. I am honestly <laughs> thinking about it. Albeit, I don't see myself getting very far in it, but hey, I can try. <laughs> and I think it'd probably I mean, go... I... Oh, go ahead. I mean, I was going to say, I joined to have fun. I didn't. I had no expectations of making playoffs, uh, and when I made playoffs, I had no expectations of being Aussie last week. And Kishmo uh, rightfully put me in my place, beat me down, left me for dead, uh, battered, bloodied, and he's going to advance to the semis. <laughs> Good job, Kishmo. <laughs> And don't tell yourself short. You did great. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> I, I mean, I don't feel like I did, but thank you. <laughs> but, but but I had a lot of fun. That was the whole point. I had a lot of fun. Oh, yes. It looked great. It was a nice, somewhat trolley seed, but still a pretty good pace. Yeah, hour uh, hour eleven for Kishmote and one seventeen for me. Yeah, that this uh, this was a seed, and I'm guessing he checked Gauntlet last, just like I did. Yep, he didn't yeah. have anywhere near as much ammo as you did either. So I think he was kind of banking on uh, finding charge pretty soon. Oh, man, just imagine if Charge hadn't been there. He would have had to do so much backtracking. I mean, by the yeah, time yeah. I got, I found Ice... By the time I found Ice Beam, I looked at my ammo, and like, okay, I need lots of ammo. Because I only had, I think, 20 missiles and 30 supers at that point. Like, I need to double my, uh, that, that count quickly. <laughs> yeah, it kind of looked, uh, uh, it looked like you were banking on a, doing a charge list. Mm-hmm. And I was just going to check the back of the gauntlet just to pick up a little bit more ammo as a little bit of a safety cushion. And there's there that was charge, charge beam. <laughs> there was that charge beam. There was like that momentary and, pause. And I was defeated. <laughs> <laughs> and again, that's again, funny. GG's to you. You did wonderful. Thank you. Uh... <sighs> Uh, I think we, uh, let's see here, what do we have coming up next? There was something on Speed Gaming, let me pull up the schedule real quick. Ah. There was a new Super Mario Bros. Wii, I think, that's not for a little while. Um, oh, I think it's Super take Mario Bros. 3. <laughs> Uh, new Super Mario Bros. Wii on Speed Gaming 2 starting right now, and then we have another perspective, whatever that is, uh, in like 10 minutes. Oh, that's what it was. Right. And then right here. And then uh, yeah, at 6 o'clock in 4 hours, we have a randomi uh, FF1 Randomizer Spring Tournament, uh, and then we have the Link to the Past Randomizer League. That's an interesting league uh, team name, the Titans Smiths. <laughs> <laughs> against the Immortals, I guess. <laughs> and then we have more FF1 Rando. We got the crossover uh, weekly uh, coming up tonight. Zelda 1 Randomizer. We have lots of action. I'm sorry, I kind of stole the spotlight from you, didn't I? Oh, no, no, no. That's fantastic, because I wasn't sure where to find a schedule, to be honest. So, stay tuned, everyone. We have lots of good things coming today. Yes, thanks for the cover on that. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, no problem. Well, I will. Uh, I'll let you sign us off then. Thank you so much for commentating. This has been fun. GD, thank you for tracking. <laughs> oh yes. Thanks for uh, watching. Give these runners a follow. Uh, it's been a great race today. This is Boil Shrimp, and I'm going to be signing out. See you next mission. Good fight. Good night.